Sometimes, you know, he's got a pretty good grip here. I'm, I'm, I'm playing, I'm playing, I'm playing. What I'm going to do is come up and insert my bottom knee. You okay, Kevin? Yes, sir. My bottom knee, like that. Now, there's a chance that he could bridge and roll me over. See what I'm doing? I want to pick this up. Some guys will hang on to this. So if he lets go and puts that foot down the bridge, he did give me what I want. No, it's perfect. <laughs> so he got his, did he win the bridge? He just gave me this arm too. That's pretty good for me. So he's got it pretty good. I'm walking, walking, I'm trying. Maybe not having much success. So I bring that knee up and insert on the bottom. I want to monitor this just in case. Now if he doesn't bridge, he's holding on this knee. I will drive it downward and pull out like that. Now most of the time, they, they want that knee out of there, and I like to keep a little hook here. Whatever his next move is, and we're being very kind on their head at this point, we don't have to. If he pushes this out, which I get quite, you're ready to come into the mount position anyway. But some, yeah, sometimes he pushes that too. We are okay with that, right? We don't mind that position, but we're fishing for the mount, so we can always work our way in. So, I'm trying to get that leg. Oh, I can't get it, so raise up. In. I like to keep a little hook. Right? Sometimes I'll drive with this knee or I'll scoot my hip toward them. And you can sometimes pull it out. Uh, most of the time when I start putting the shin in, it changes the angle of that leg and allows me to pull it out anyway or they feel that there's a chance to bridge, I get that a lot too. I just have to be ready for it. I want to monitor the leg.